It was 1957. I was 11 years old when my dad's father, Oscar Carlson, a Methodist lay preacher, gave me a copy of a daily devotional book that was used by Abraham Lincoln. Originally entitled The Believer's Daily Treasure, it was published by the London Religious Tract Society in 1852. It has been a companion in my library for 63 years, and I've often turned to it for my own devotional time. In preparing to bring today's devotion to you, I was once again drawn to what helped Abraham Lincoln in the dark days of leading a country that was coming apart over the issues of slavery and states' rights, plus a dark cloud of a potential civil war. Each month of the devotional is based on a focused topic for a believer. The month of June is entitled, Duties of the Believer to the World. The devotional for June 3rd is entitled, The Universal Rule of Equity, and is based on Matthew 7:12. Here's what Lincoln read. All things, whatsoever ye would that men should do to you, do ye even so to them. For this is the law and the prophets. Obviously, that's from the authorized King James Version. Today we would hear this from the New International Version, which reads, read, So in everything, do to others what you would have them do to you. For this sums up the law and the prophets. Matthew 7, 12. Consider how Jesus wants us to understand and put into practice these words of his. Can you identify with these thoughts and questions? I want people to like me. Do I like them? I want people to respect me. Do I respect them? I want people to forgive me. Do I forgive them? I want people to listen to me. Do I listen to them? My list, my friends, can go on and on and on. How about yours? What a world we could experience if we lived by the universal rule of equity. I close with the prayer in the Lincoln devotional, as Lincoln would have prayed it himself. Blessed Redeemer, how divine, how righteous is this rule of thine, to do to all men just the same as we expect or wish from them. How blessed would every nation prove thus ruled by equity and love. All would be friends without a foe and form a paradise below. Amen. God bless you all.